how how our people self harvest themselves from the lava. As we said in our previous video, that within the same harvested arched and fed larvae, we have different stages in which we have some that are still in their larvae stage, some are in their pre pupa stage. And as we know, if we delay these that are turning to pre pupa from maybe self harvesting or we harvesting by ourselves. Inside this point, they will turn to pupa and they will also turn to flies, of which some percentage of our flies may be lost because we can't be picking the flies once they turn to flies. Now, the easiest way of harvesting your pre pupa from your pond is to design a self harvesting pond for your pre pupa. As you see, this is the bow pond that we feed our larvae. These are the these are the bow pond that we use to feed our larvae. But any one that we want to raise for the next propagation, we transfer them into this self harvesting pond for them to harvest themselves. As we know, once as we are feeding this larvae. This black swan, they will locate a dry area or they self harvest themselves to this dry area. As you can see, they are walking out of the feed into the dry area where we easily collect them into another container. Once you build this type of pond, as you can see, this type of pond, you will have a less stress because your pre pupa will self-harvest themselves into the dry area and also for those who are using some like this bow pond you want to you also want to self harvest your larvae just make sure that your larvae are in the middle and you have a dry feed at the four corner of your or bow pond. As you feed your larvae, the pre pupa will walk into the dry area and you will collect them into another container. I say if you don't have this kind of pond, even if you have this kind of pond, there are some that are lazy that will still come to the dry area. They can be easily they can be easily collected as you have seen these are the pre pupa there they can be easily collected so also if you are using this kind of pond just have a dry area where your pre pupa can walk to for collection anytime you want to collect them because if you are we are feeding them and we are not harvesting them. As they are counting this, this lava are turning to darker, we turn to prepupa. And if we don't provide any means for them to harvest themselves or 
we harvest them. Like you can see now, these are the poppers. If you don't collect these ones now, when we, we soup them out, they will turn to flies and they will fly away. That's what we are doing here to make sure that we save harvest our pre pooper from our bow pond that we still have our larvae. Thank you once again, and you welcome.